go, here I go. Going as fast as I can, okay. Alright, I'm checking that out. Okay. 220 minus my age. Should I be concerned with my target heart rate when I'm strength training? No with a little asterisk. I say no because it's fine to monitor your heart rate as you're going through your workout, but we have to remember that that heart rate, that chart, that target heart rate, it's just a number. And it's one way to determine your, the intensity of your workout, but is it the best way? As we train, our body becomes more efficient. When our be body becomes more efficient, it doesn't have to work as hard. So that's why that heart, target heart rate is kind of a moving target. Other things factor into that heart rate. Uh, it could be hot, humid. You could be under a lot of stress, which is gonna affect your heart rate. You could be on different medications, which could also affect your heart rate. And also age. Um, so there's all these different puzzle pieces that factor into what is a good target heart rate for you as you're working out. Research shows that instead of focusing on that target heart rate and doing your 220 minus your age and trying to figure out what that max rate is and then 60, 50, 70 percent of that max rate, a simpler way to calculate if you're in a good target heart rate zone would be what we call the talk test. If you're talking, carrying on normal conversation because you're taking a walk leisurely with your friend, you're going to be at a very minimal heart rate increase, right? Um, if you're kind of going up to more of a speed walk, if you're doing an MRT session where you can say a few words, take a breath, um, you have to pause, that's going to be kind of your target heart rate. If you're going at such a high intensity, that you cannot talk, that's going to be a big red flag, right? You're going to be that your heart rate's up too high, your body's going into crazy town, um, and you need to slow down because it's not healthy for your heart to be in those really high intensity target heart rates for a really a long amount of time. So now that you know you don't have to do a lot of calculating with that target heart rate during your strength training exercise, just take the talk test.